Welcome everybody to the Zero Knowledge Summit. You've made it all the way here. Let's give ourselves a round of applause. Yeah. So as you may or may not know, the Zero Knowledge Summit is presented by the Zero Knowledge Podcast, which I hope you're listening to. And if not, you can find us on the iTunes store, etc. We're going to start off with a little bit of practical info about this event to help you out. Yeah, so practical info, basics. The first and most important thing is Wi-Fi. There is Wi-Fi. And uh, SSID is this. The password is snarks with three S's at the end. Uh, so hopefully you'll, you'll find that and it works. Uh, it seems to have worked decently in the past events, so hopefully it works well now too. We do have a, a Telegram group uh, that relatively active, both like in, inside this event, but outside the event as well, and just generally. So please join it if you haven't already. There should be a link in the email invite that you received, uh, but there's also a link to it in, uh, from our Twitter profile. And there are amenities, so we'll be serving lunch, uh, but there's coffee all day. Uh, there's plenty of coffee breaks, so you can socialize and um, yeah, there'll be drinks in the evening until eight. So I wanna say a little something about the program this time. We, last time we got some feedback about, we had sort of programmed a little bit too much at the same time. And so this time we're gonna have two stages and two breakouts, but you may have noticed there's an extra room. So there's actually gonna be an extra room where you can, it's called the whiteboarding brainstorming room. I think we called it the zero knowledge room, the knowledge room. Uh, something like that. Um, so yeah, that is a room that's open. There's, I think, two flipboards and a whiteboard and a table, and that's a really good place if you want to do like a little unconference breakout session yourself. That would be a good place to do it. Please don't use that room for conference calls or don't close the door and start just like working quietly. We want that to be open. Here is the program. So for the first session, we're going to all stay in this room, and then there's a break, and then we break out. Uh, there is the ZK Proof workshop that you should have also had an invite to apply to. That's like kind of a fixed block and they're gonna close the door on that one. Um, yeah, so if you are in that one, go find it. I don't know if it's sold out, but if not, maybe just knock on the door at the very beginning and see if they still have some room. This is the afternoon. So I just realized something. We didn't actually introduce ourselves. <laughs> I'm Anna. Good to do. Yeah, maybe we do this. My name so, is Frederick. Yeah, this is Frederick. I'm Anna, and we have the Zero Knowledge Podcast. And we take this opportunity every time to share a little bit of a recap or just talk a little bit about where, you know, how far we've come, what we're doing, that kind of stuff. Yeah, so it's it's uh, been a long project. I mean, it started out as a hobby thing, and it, is, it still is to some degree, but we have 69 episodes and counting. And uh, we managed to ship an episode every week of all of 2018, and so far doing well in 2019 as well. So um, went better than expected, I think, <laughs> switching to a weekly. Um, I and remember that seeming totally <coughs> impossible. And you're like, let's yeah. do it every week, and I'm like, what? <laughs> That's crazy. Um, and we've gotten better, I think. I mean, we've upgraded our gear over the years, and upgraded our technique and our editing and we've gotten some dedicated sound engineering support from uh, Henrik in the back there. Uh, so it, I think quality is hopefully increasing, you can notice it, but... Um, Thanks. <laughs> uh, we like to highlight the, the most listened to episodes. <clears throat> Sorry. And... Um, They've more or less all switched around from the last event, except uh, the in intro to Snarks. And um, it's kind of interesting to see how this evolves. So I think we've gotten more and more into zero knowledge, actual zero knowledge topics and research and cryptography, uh, which is interesting. But we also still see a lot of popularity just from general blockchain decentralized web topics. So what is your favorite episode so far, can you say? I still like sitting down talking to Zuko about Zcash. So that episode, as we shipped it, I think was an hour, 15 minutes or something like that. We probably sat him down and talked with him for like two and a half hours. Yeah. He's so fun to talk to. So I, that, that's definitely my favorite. I think, I think mine may have been a recent one, this XDI episode. I think that's a really interesting project. And it was fun to have Igor and Austin on. Oh. <laughs> There's some fans in the back, huh? Cool. 
All right, so I want to share a little bit about what we have next um, coming up for the Zero Knowledge podcast. So our plan is to do more and even maybe bigger events. Uh, we want to do more videos. So we did a few interviews and we did some live streams. We have a YouTube channel. Who knew? Anyway, <laughs> we're thinking of doing more. And we're always, I'd say like we've now gotten to a point where we can look for partners and sponsors to start working with us. We try to keep it to like one sponsor per episode. But if there's anyone in the audience who'd be interested, this would be a, probably a good time to connect with us about that. We also have this project that some of you know, and some of you are in this group. We have another Telegram group called the Study Club, and this started out of just like an interest in learning more about S Starks. I wanted to, I thought like, oh, I want to find like eight people to like learn about Starks with me, and it's grown into a, like an entity. Matthew, who's the kind of co-admin and co-coordinator, oh, he's right there. If this is, if you're not in this group and you're interested, please get in touch with Matthew or myself. We'll give you an invite to the Telegram group. And we try to do like bi-monthly hangouts where we talk about a paper or a video or some concept. It's not really a presentation per se, it's more like a study club, <laughs> like the name. I wish I had more time to spend in that group. <laughs> there you go. So yeah, about this event, uh, it is the third edition, and we're trying to focus in this event on um, specifically like zero knowledge, snark, stark topics, and specifically around scaling. So as you may or may not know, there is this exponential speed up in verification over proof generation uh, when it comes to snarks and starks. So they have pretty interesting scaling properties and um, hopefully we can kick that off with a talk that's right after this. So in the application form, you may have noticed we asked a question. We asked the question, how would you explain the trusted setup to a friend? And we got a lot of interesting answers. It's not always the easiest to explain, and we're gonna share a couple of these with you now. Um, <laughs> here's one. <laughs> So yeah, nuclear waste that makes you glow. Um, maybe, yeah. <laughs> Just listen to the Radiolab podcast episode, ha ha. That was nice as podcasters to receive that one. <laughs> when you move into a new house, do you change the locks? If the locks, what if the locks can't be changed? I didn't really understand this one. To me, it's more like, <laughs> If you construct a house and want the house to never be opened, how do you make sure that you throw away the keys correctly? But <laughs> If at least one of us is honest, we are both okay. A good friend ceremony. <laughs> Crypto party for ice breaking. It would be a funny icebreaker, the long party though. <laughs> I promise I will think of something funny later. This person was clearly at the last event and knew that this might be happening. We cast a spell to prevent lying about money. You can only lie if you know all the magic words. That's, That's pretty a accurate. Bad one. You participate in a communal ritual in which a wizard instructs you what to do. You might be able to get a YouTube video out of it blowtorching your hardware. <laughs> I thought that was a good one. <laughs> that awkward thing that Starks don't need. <laughs> MPC for starters. So this one is actually uh, pretty good. Many people <laughs> come together to create a secret that will be re revealed to none of the individuals. The only way it can be compromised is, is if all the people collaborate and thereby compromise. And to the question, how would you explain trusted setup to a friend, someone wrote, I just wish it was gone and I did not have to. I like that one. Cool. So thanks again for those answers. There were some really, really long ones that are interesting. Maybe we should find a place to share some of these. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Doesn't fit on a slide. Doesn't fit on a slide, but anyway, cool. So we want to say thank you to some of our supporters to ha who've helped make this event possible. Um, we want to especially thank our sponsors, New Cypher, Trail of Bits, Parody, Web3 Foundation. Starkware, POA. 1KX, I think all of them are in the audience. <laughs> and we also have drink sponsorship by the Zcash Foundation and private storage. Yes. I want to say thank you to the programming committee. This is kind of the first time we did this, but we grabbed a couple people from the community to actually help when we got these applications. Oh yeah, that's maybe something to note. 
the entire program came from applications. So this was very much a like a community-driven programming effort. Um, I want to say thank you to Lucas, uh, Jacob, and you, and Barry Whitehead, who I don't think is going to make it. But I want to th say thank you to all of you guys. I definitely, you know appreciated the help and I think it's a better program because you were there. And I think we have to especially thank Anna. She's done 99.9% .9 of the work with all of this. Aww. Aww, thanks. <laughs> That's very nice of you to say, but there is a group of people who've also helped. I want to say thank you to Balash and to Lorenzo and to Raul who's downstairs and to you and to Henrik who's doing the videos. Yeah, cool. Okay, now we can start into the program. Um, maybe just to, I sort of mentioned this just before, so we're gonna stay here for the next half hour, then we have a break, and then you can see all of the sessions sort of start to happen in parallel. And I think this is just the end. We, this is our past, the Wi-Fi, you have posters around, you also have this schedule posted around if you need to find it. And like we just mentioned, if you wanna get into that Telegram, chat, or if you want to just follow us on Twitter, this is our Twitter handle. Oh, actually, huh, it's wrong. Zero Knowledge FM. <laughs> I'll, I'll fix that after. Okay, cool. All right, and uh, I want to introduce our first speaker, Av Avihu Levy, uh, to talk about scalability first with Starks. Yeah, thanks a lot.